If you remember, during the election campaign, the candidate uh, of the opposition, Svetlana Tikhanovskaya, was always flanked with by two other women. That was Maria Kolesnikova and Veronika Tsepkalo. Veronika Tsepkalo and Svetlana Tikhanovskaya both fled Belarus, and Maria Kolesnikova was the only one of the trio who stayed in the country and, until today, was at liberty and was a constant presence at demonstrations and became something of a prominent figure in the opposition. At the time of speaking, we don't know where she is or who kidnapped her. The Interior Ministry denies that it is holding her. This evening, her family formally registered her as missing with the police, who promised to investigate. But of course, everybody suspects that it is the regime itself that has taken her. And it's perhaps worth remembering at this point that there is precedent in Belarus for opposition leaders disappearing. In 1999, Yuri Zatarenka and and Viktor Honchar went missing and were never found, two leading opposition figures. So the memory of that, the awareness of that, can only add to the concern for Maria Kolesnikova's safety at the moment, for as long as the Interior Ministry can't or won't confirm her whereabouts.